केंद्रीय नागरिक उड़न मंत्री ज्योतिरादित्य सिंधिया ने कहा कि भारत के लिए 2030 तक इस्पात क्षेत्र में अपनी श्रेष्ठता स्थापित करना महत्वपूर्ण है उन्होंने कहा कि हमारा उद्देश्य अंतर्राष्ट्रीय स्तर पर चुनौतियों का सामना करने में सक्षम होना है हम शुद्ध आयातक से शुद्ध निर्यातक बन गए हैं हमारा स्टील दुनिया भर में निर्यात किया जा रहा है वॉट आर दी एजेंडा पॉइंट ऑफ दिस कॉन्फ्रेंस एंड वॉट यू रियली एक्सपेक्ट आई थिंक इट्स एक्सट्रीमली इम्पोर्टेंट इन ऑर्डर टू एस्टेब्लिश India's preeminence in the steel sector by 2030 our aim which is to double our capacity from our current 155 million tons to almost about 300 million tons per annum along with that to be able to face the challenges that the steel sector is going to face internationally the whole issue of carbon emissions green steel uh making sure that we involve the circular economy all of those are agenda items uh for today's conference because at the end of the day when we work with our state governments when we work with our private sector players when we work with our public sector players in all our stakeholder success lies india's success and that is the aim of this state ministers conference Uh, which is being held all day today and we hope to uh, from this conference nil uh, solutions uh, new ideas innovative thinking to be able to take our sector forward so what sort of opportunities are there for indian domestic steel players in the international market and what are the there are tremendous opportunities the very fact that we have graduated over the last 8 years from being a net importer to being a net exporter we've graduated from being the fourth largest producer to the second largest producer we've graduated today to becoming the second largest consumer in the world the fact that a huge infrastructure push by prime minister narendra modi is resulting in huge demand for steel across the length and breadth of india and not only that it is our imperative to ensure that our steel companies become not indian leaders but global leaders today our steel is being exported across the world 